Hey guys, today we're gonna check out the most expensive TWS earbuds ever released by Sennheiser, the Conversation Clear Plus. It isn't just about the audio. These are noise cancelling earbuds designed to filter speech from noise. Say you're in a noisy cafe having a coffee with a friend or a date and it's hard to hear her, just pop these ones in and boom, noise goes down and you can now hear her clearly. And your chances of getting out of that friend zone just got higher. I'm just kidding, once you're in the friend zone, there's no getting out. Anyway, despite its high price point of $849.95, what are its pros and cons? And how does it really perform in terms of its mic pickup, ANC, and sound quality? We're gonna listen to some binaural sound samples, so I recommend listening to this video with earbuds to hear all the details. And if you wanna see more of such reviews from this channel, get subscribed and tap the bell button to stay notified. If you've had any experience with Sennheiser Momentum earbuds, you need to set all of that aside because this isn't anything like the popular, say, MTW3. There is a focus on speech pass-through, and it uses a totally different app called the Conversation Clear app. It's where you can toggle between the speech enhancing communication mode, the relax mode, which performs general active noise cancelling and pass through, and the app also lets you adjust the transparency in each mode to your preferred levels. You can also switch between the different modes using the button controls. And by using the same buttons, you can ramp up and down the level of transparency versus the noise cancelling. When you're playing music, you can also use the buttons to rebalance the amount of transparency versus the music's volume, which is nice for people who want that open fit feeling without losing bass response. Plus, it also jacks up the volume of the earbuds, such that playing your music at 30% volume on these sound like 60% on other earbuds. It's that loud. The learning curve is quite steep. However, it's been a long time since I've had to read the manual to learn how to work the controls. But of course, being a fast learner, I got used to it pretty quickly. Anyway, I've recorded some samples in a noisy cafe, showing you exactly what the different modes do and how well the Conversation Clear Plus picks up voices. Okay, so this is the Sennheiser Conversation Clear Plus on communication mode at speech volume level 11, which is midpoint. I'm going to increase the speech volume pass through till maximum. This is maximum at level 16. Uh, and well, basically you should be able to hear my voice better compared to before. Now I'm going to decrease all the way to level 6. This is speech volume at level 6. Right now my voice should be a, a lot more receded in the background, not as clear or loud as before. This is level 16 again, and this time around, I am gonna turn on clarity boost mode, which is, a, which is supposed to increase the uh, level of the high frequencies, so my voice sounds sharper, crisper. Let's do that. So this is my voice at level 16 speech volume with clarity boost on communication mode. Okay, what I'm going to do next is to toggle into relax mode, which is um, active noise cancelling basically. So let's turn on relax mode now. Relax mode activated. You can sort of hear the background receding. And now it's very soft and very muffled. I'm going to turn on pass through, and this I do by increasing the volume of the external sound. To 100%. This is 100% on relax mode. It's supposed to let in some noise, but still cutting much of the noise in the background. But if you don't want that, you can always turn on full noise cancellation. Never zero, zero. 
represent external noise cascade. I'm going to turn on communication mode again. So guys, this is the Sennheiser Conversation Clear Plus. This helps. So that was a rundown of the different modes. In conversation mode, what I did like is how the birds are always listening to how noisy the environment is and adjusting its pass-through accordingly for the best pass-through results. But what I didn't quite like is clarity boost because too much brightness annoys me. That's why I leave it turned off. Now, as for its active noise cancelling in relax mode, it was quite effective. Good enough for some peace and quiet. But of course, if we were to compare it to the Bose QC2 earbuds, those do cancel more noise when tested in a simulated noisy scenario using some really loud cafe style background noise. Have a listen. Now we're going to test its phone call quality in three parts. First, under simulated conditions, both quiet and noisy, using some really loud cafe style background noise and some wind noise coming from this fan. And after that, in the same real cafe that I tested these buds in before. I am now making a phone call in a quiet place using the Sennheiser Conversation Clear Plus. I am now making a phone call in a noisy place using the Sennheiser Conversation Clear Plus. A quick round pump jumps over the lazy bag. Okay, so I'm making a phone call right now using the Sennheiser Condensation Plus in a noisy cafe. The quick loud box jumps over the lazy dog. Hope my voice sounds clear because these earbuds, these are pretty expensive. So its mic pickup in quiet conditions is quite usable, but in noisy conditions, its background noise reduction wasn't that great and it wasn't able to reject wind noise either and somehow the audio sounded quite choppy overall i mean this is okay for phone calls indoors not so much for outdoor use though by the way guys if you want to compare these headphones call quality and active noise cancelling to other earbuds do become a member for one dollar per month or more this gives you full access to my personal comparison tool which you can use to compare earbuds a to b at your own time and at your own pace many people have joined up because they know that this is going to save them so much time being able to just cut through all the marketing and compare these earbuds remotely so become a member like them click on the link below to find out more now we're going to talk about its sound quality when listening to music or audio now this has a different sound signature from the momentums those tend to be a bit more bass heavy especially the momentum tw3 and those do have more airiness and spread in the soundstage but if we look at the clear plus on its own merits it does sound clean and punchy with a bit more crispiness in the vocals now before i continue about its sound i want you guys to listen to the following sound samples comparing the clear plus to the mtw3 and tell me in the comments what you think
And by the way, guys, if you want to compare these earbuds' sound quality to other earbuds, visit loudandwireless.com's sound samples page. Link in the description. What's weird about the Clear Plus' sound is that it's got a steep drop above 10 kilohertz. I'm not sure what the reason is for that since I'm not an engineer, but since these have a heavy emphasis on speech transparency, this has probably got to do with keeping sibilance in check so that ambient sounds don't peak too much in the highs even when you're listening to music. This is supported by the fact that you can't customize the Clear Plus's sound at all using the app. There are no EQ presets or graphic EQ, unlike the Momentum TW3. It's like you're not supposed to toy around with its sound, otherwise it could affect something else. But this does have one of the best transparencies around, and it does an excellent job of picking up voices. I remember using this for the first time. It was at a Sennheiser demo in a ballroom. And using these, I could pick up conversations around me, even far away chatter close to the ballroom's exit. That was impressive. So if you're looking for a voice filter, a voice enhancer, at this moment, I can't think of anything better than the Conversation Clear Plus. That being said, as a pair of earbuds, it's not perfect. Now, everything I'm about to say, I'm not saying it because I'm bashing this product. It's because I see a lot of promise in something like this, and I want Sennheiser to make a better version in future. First, the connectivity. These do support multi-point pairing. That's awesome because it's just more convenient being able to just connect the buds to both my PC and my phone at the same time but it gets pretty wonky pretty fast. No disconnections, thankfully, but sometimes it's impossible to play the audio because it randomly pauses and plays the music on its own. And once it's in that pause play loop, there's no other way to fix this other than to reset the buds connection with the device. Its call quality could be a lot better. I mean, we covered that, especially at rejecting noise and wind noise. There are also no voice prompts for something so different. It only makes it harder to navigate the different functions without the app. So overall, it goes without saying that the Sennheiser Conversation Clear Plus is targeted at a very specific segment of the market. It's very specialized. If you want a voice filter for conversing in noisy places instead of the usual amplify everything transparency, this is your guy. Now, it's true that there are products with focus on voice transparency, like the Sony WF-1000XM4, but so far, none of them do it to the same level of finesse as the Conversation Clear Plus. But at this moment, it also needs to be more polished in terms of sound, connectivity, call quality, and user experience in order to justify that eye-watering price. Perhaps a future software update will improve this product, just like how updates improved the MTW3. But as of this video, this is where the Sennheiser Conversation Clear Plus stands in my book. Thanks for watching. For more reviews like this one from this channel, get subscribed and tap the bell button to stay notified. Smash like and share to refill my HP. I'm also on Discord, so if you have Discord, come and join the chat. Link is in the description. Now, I've also made a video about which are the best earbuds of 2023. Click here to watch it or watch another video from this channel, because you're a legend.